Speaker, the Canadian National Institute for the Blind must lobby each year for funding in the form of government grants. Given the crucial services provided by the CNIB, like making sure literature is available in accessible formats, stable, predictable and ongoing funding is required. Funding would allow the CNIB to provide Canadians with visual impairments the programs and services to which they're entitled. Will the government commit to ensuring that funding for the CNIB will be in the next federal budget? Honourable Minister for Sport and Persons with Disabilities. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I'd like to thank my honourable colleague for the question. I know she shares the passion for inclusion and accessibility for people with disabilities that our government does. Mr. Speaker, I've experienced firsthand the great work that CNIB does for visually impaired community in Canada. I was proud to work with them over the last year to celebrate Canada's accession to the Marrakesh Treaty, and I'm proud of our government commitment of $3 million to ensure we can meet the demands for alternative format materials. Our government's disability <coughs> program has been undergoing a transformation aimed at providing great, greater certainty and efficiency to organizations, and we are indeed exploring whether or not we can provide multi-year funding. Thank you.